here. Welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus Dailies. We are Eden today. Oh, God, that's awful. So is that. And that. Alright, well. It looks like today is just going to be complete and utter trash. Unless I get a decent tears up quickly. Like, I don't know if I can kill these spiders faster than he can make them. At least I'm getting occasional tears in on him to... Okay, thank god. weird. I don't think I've ever seen a red poop inside that little walled-off area before. Uh, okay, duct tape is actually terrible. Uh, I don't really want 404 because it can give me weird trinkets that screw stuff up occasionally. Wow. For walking into the fire that saved me like six tears. At least my damage is, you know, like cane sized instead of Eve sized. I wouldn't say no to the heart container here, because it will also heal my Amazing. More money. 
not terrible. I have two keys. I'll go ahead and open this. Mystery sack can be good. Alright, no tinted rocks in here. I wish he had spawned with a couple of goons. The number of shots Lusty Blood would have saved would have made up for, you know, the tears it took to kill the goons to begin with. save the bomb. Hopefully I get a soul heart from the... Uh, whatchamacallit? From the... Uh, crystal ball next floor. Holy hell, how did I walk into that? Apparently the segments on these guys no longer count as individual enemies, huh? Oh, even killing the whole thing doesn't count now. Oh, I've never used that. Jeez. That could have been awful. Alright. Bomb into the seeker room. Hopefully it'll have bombs in it so I can get to the shop without having to use a key. That will leave me with the key for the... Um, although I can shoot stuff from forever away and that'll maximize the... Uh, lump of coal damage bonus. basically going to have a charge by the next floor. <coughs> a super lucky dodge there. Those would be useful. Oh yeah, there was no, like, actual devil room. 
last floor, so I have a chance of getting angel rooms, which is... Eh? Oh, Mystery Sack gave me that. Yeah, I've got enough soul hearts, I can... go to the curse room without really worrying about it. Too bad it was a waste. wasn't going to die, but then the bloodshot eye, you know, snuck in a little bit of damage. There's a not inconsiderable chance that this is the Super Seeker. So I'll just pretend that was a Tinted Rock. or time in the air. Okay, good dodge. Because, like, I don't know if high shot speed hurts the damage output or not. Alright. Last key gives me four keys, and now I have positive luck. And it's looking like this was a waste of a Joker card. Not that I had any way of knowing. I'm only one room away from getting the... what should we call it? Uh, okay. Oh, dang it. They were just far enough apart to catch me there. Son of crap. And then he... reconstituted himself just late enough that he went around the bottom. And this room is hell. maximum distance you can leap. I didn't know that. He's making enough creep that I would think he was the champion, but he's not. There's that yellow champion that makes extra sized creep. I wish I had piercing shots. <coughs> Holy freaking only plus point six seven. It's been giving me plus point nine three. Wait, but why am I at seven damage then? Maybe the eyeballs triggered before he did and I didn't notice. I don't know why the eyeballs would count for kills though if segments of the, you know, human centipedes don't. All 
Alright, that room took a while, but it went better than I expected. I'm not gonna come back here for a battery. Go ahead and do that. Weird place for the secret room to be. Plenty of money, but there hasn't been like anything in a shop that I've wanted. I was hoping for a uh, dark beggar shop or a multi beggar arcade because then I could blow up the regular one and play the dark beggar and hopefully get something decent. Absolutely, yes, take a blood bag, because that puts me, like, I was a little low on speed, I hadn't even commented, because it was barely low on speed, but it's getting to the point where it's starting to get annoying. Head was in the way. 
my fault though, because it's, you know, I went too close to him, period. Whatever the range doesn't really matter. And then these are terrible. Like, I mean, Lusty Blood can be okay, but it doesn't really help on bosses 90% of the time. No Devil Room Teleport, just freaking bombs. So what, um, thank you for killing your buddy. What, ah, son of a crap, mini boss, do I even want to fight? Ah, gotta itch my eye. Alright, nine lives would be okay. Like, I don't have any, um, items. are it's going to be um uh, what you call it next floor greed I have not had a single shop with a re-roller or item room for that matter Daddy Long Legs is a depths boss, right? It's uh triacid that's in the womb, I think. That could be a super secret room. I've got fourteen bombs, so thank you. Figured it was worth a check. Thank you for killing him in one 
one shot daddy one likes. You know, something for Soul Heart. Although if I got another um, Empress or something, dang it, Moon is not helpful. I'm gonna say if I were to get another Empress or something, I could use one on this boss and one on. <sighs> they telefrag me. And then it's a useless super secret room. Great. Son of a friggin'. I hate those things. Spawn spiders. And then you can't see the spiders for the crap. Thank you. Absolutely should not have gotten hit by that, let me tell you. Okay, that black room. Was super useful. Okay, I made the dodge. Thank God he's making enemies that strengthen me when they die. Up to a point. And of course it's the strong angel. Okay. Thank God he made little angels that got hit by that. In case you're wondering, I'm fighting this guy so I can black rune the key piece at the same time. I black rune the uh breath of life. Oh, thank God. Good tears up and a damage up. I'll just take this because I don't have a, another black room. I don't remember what this does. But okay. That tears is a major upgrade. That's helpful. can get in that trap room. Ancient Recall. Might be worth something. Use the Magician.
know. I would think that was a secret room if I didn't know where the secret room was already. Down below here. I don't know what cards I would be looking for. I'm already at full health, so that doesn't matter. Okay. Just hope restock shows up, I guess. Nope. Well, that's the second time friggin' the golden horseshoe increases the number of gold or lucky pennies you get. I've gotten a ton of lucky pennies since I picked up the gold horseshoe. Not really before. Oh, it hasn't been to the atom room yet. Duh. of a crap. I did not want little baggy little bit or wait. No little baggy is terrible. And then I walk right into that. Use that. Because Daddy Long Legs is likely to just be slightly late. Thank you, Dad. 
if not for Daddy Longlegs, everything would just be so terrible. Oh yeah, the reason I was hoping this wasn't going to be greed was because of the stupid, um, uh, like, I needed to keep her in there to get a better double room chance. Okay, made it, barely. I don't have any syringes yet. But I want son of a crap. Hopefully there's a tears up pill somewhere. Accidentally stood right outside the line of fire of that, so that was super lucky. Yeah, I guess I can't get into there. That retribution's useless. Getting tons of money. has just saved my butt so many times now. Holy cow, like, most of these rooms would be so incredibly worse for me. probably saved me 20 tears. That's tears that hit. I'm just going to use two bombs because I've done some bombs. Well, that's not hugely helpful. And that's not the super secret. If I take too much damage, and what? So let's see, if I take too much damage and lose my double room chance here, I'm going to be so pissed off. Well, I can fly. I was heading out to up soul hearts and then I decided to turn around and <sighs> yeah, 
but then I decided to turn around and, uh, oh yeah, I can fly now. Pick up the heart container, but I misjudged it and wound up freaking compost. Seriously, have I gotten... Okay, d damage ups I've gotten are... Lusty Blood. I should have been going to Double Rooms, really. Yeah, Lusty Blood, which is kind of a damage up. Then, uh, <sighs> Champion's Belt, that's the name of it. I saw the icon and I just could not remember what it was called. No devil room, of course. Check. 
Alright, well, too bad that won't actually take me, you know, down any further. No tinted rocks. I could sac like if there is no sacrifice room. I was gonna say I could sacrifice down, but what would be the point? I would just get completely wrecked. But then they took the choice away from me, and I'm kind of glad because I don't have to justify not doing it when there's enough health on the ground. Because holy crap, this is just a ridiculously bad run. Remember, don't let the damage fool you. That's after I've, you know, mauled three waves of enemies with lusty blood. Like, 6.9 damage is caves one or two. <clears throat> like, where you want to be. Nine tiers is, you know, barely. Oh, there's another 48 hour energy. You know what, screw it. Maybe I'll manage something decent. Tears down exists. We found that out. But yeah, nine tiers is like a rounding error away from starting tiers for almost every character. And 6.9 damage is third or fourth floor, you know, for most characters. That's like, I found Cricket's head. Yes. 
what did I get stuck on? Because I stopped moving for a second, even though I didn't let go of the button. I can freaking fly. obnoxious. Yeah, 345th place. No boss rush, no hush, 9,000 damage penalty, and only 832nd or 37th on time. Jeez. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe if you would, and I'll see you guys next time.